Hey guys, we are back today with another video about test anxiety. So last time we made a video, we discussed what test anxiety is. And today we are going to discuss a strategy to help you understand how to handle that anxiety you may be feeling leading up to test day and on test day. And one thing that we're going to talk about today is your circle of control. And inside your circle of control are all the things that you can control. And outside your circle of control are all the things that you cannot control. So inside, you can control you. You can control your thoughts, your feelings, and what you do. And outside of your circle of control is everything else. And when you focus on the things that you can control, you can feel a lot better and more confident leading into test day. So right now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go through these things on the outside to see if they are in our circle of control or outside our circle of control. All right guys, so we're gonna go through these and see if you can control them. We'll put them in the circle of control or leave them outside if we cannot control them. So the first thing is, if I study or practice, can you decide that you study or practice? Yes. So that is inside your control. What about the questions on the test? Can you control the questions on the test? No. So that is outside of your circle of control. Your effort, the effort that you put forth when you were doing the test. That's up to you to decide how hard that you try. You can control that. When I go to bed the night before the test. When you go to bed is up to you. Going to bed and getting a good night's rest is very important before test taking day. How you speak to yourself on test day. Do you think you can control that? If you say, oh, I'm going to do awesome on this test. Or, oh no, this is not going to be good. It really affects the way that you think. So of course that's something that you can control to make sure that you keep those thoughts positive. Your breathing. Your breathing is something that you can learn to control so that we're going to put that inside the circle of control as well. Other people's pace or progress. When you're taking a test, can you control how quickly the people around you are taking it? No, that's not something that you control. You just need to focus on you. When the test is scheduled, you cannot control when the test is scheduled. So that remains outside of your control. So looking at this, we have three things that are outside of your control and the rest are things inside of your circle of control. So when you focus, like what Ms. Stenman said, on the things that you can control, it helps you to feel more prepared when it comes to test day. Having a plan for how your test day will go is a great strategy to help you feel less anxious on test day. Let's look through this My Plan for Test Prep Success together to see what things you can control on test day. Number one, I will do these things to get organized the night before the test. Pack my backpack, pack my lunch, pack a snack, set out my clothes, set my alarm clock, something else. Being prepared when you wake up in the morning and knowing that you have everything ready for test day is a great way to help you feel ready for the test that is coming. Number two, I will go to bed at what time and get up at what time. Knowing when you're going to sleep and getting up is another great strategy for test day. Remember, it is so important that you get enough sleep the night before a test. Number three, I will have breakfast at home, on the way to school, at school. Now, if you pick at school, you may not have a choice of what's for breakfast, but maybe you can talk with somebody at home to make sure you have a nutritious breakfast the morning of test day. That is also so important to help you be successful when it comes to the test. Number four, I will get to school by walking, riding my bike, riding the bus, riding in the car, 
or something else. Now, again, this may be something that may not be in your control, but knowing the way that you're getting to school on that morning may help you feel ready and prepared for test day. And the last one, number five, maybe one of my favorite ones, is before the test starts, I will say these things to myself. I really want you guys to take a couple minutes and think of a couple phrases that you can have ready on that test day morning and during the test. It can be as simple as, I got this, because you do. So come up with a couple phrases right now of different things that you can use on test day morning and as the test day goes on. All right, guys, so we hope that you learned a little bit more about your circle of control today. And remember, when you focus on the things that you can control, you feel a lot more in control. So don't worry about all these things that are outside of it. Those things are coming anyway. And focus on the things that you can change and you can control. And that will help you feel more prepared come test day. So with remembering that and using your plan for test prep success that we talked through, you should feel a little bit more confident when test day comes and telling yourself that you're gonna do the best that you can and everything's gonna be just fine.